Hello, my most amazing artists. Today we are going to be using oil pastels to finish these beautiful trees. We're going to jazz them up a bit. Let's start with our brown and we're going to look at the tree trunks and we are going to draw them very lightly in the water part, the bottom half. So if you notice, I'm just kind of pressing down lightly. I'm not making them as dark. Then we'll go in and we'll add the Y part and add some branches. They don't have to match the top, but they should look similar. So it makes sense to start with the Y and then add some branches. Finish those up and remember, don't press down hard. Your brown should be lighter in the bottom than in the top. When you're finished with the branches, you're gonna get a white oil pastel and you are just going to color all over the bottom half. So I'm coloring lines in a horizontal motion. So don't go vertically, but go horizontally. That means side to side. And if you notice, my brown oil pastel is starting to kind of bleed out. It's not really bleeding, but it, it's, it's smudging out. And that is what is gonna give this the water look. So don't press down as hard as you can with the oil pastel. Just press down gently and put a lot of it on there. Okay, to finish these up, we are going to add detail in the top half. So I'm taking my oil pastels and I'm gonna draw right on top of the paint. I'm not coloring in solid because I still wanna see my paint in the background, but I'm just adding some lines of grass. I'm using the dark green. I might use some light green in a minute. I'm also going to color in on the trees and just add more detail. You can add um, flowers, you could add clouds, you're the artist, you could make your leaves look like real leaves, but just add details only in the top half. We don't want any details in the bottom half because we want that to look like water. This is not going to take you that long. It took me maybe five minutes to do this. It'll take you a little bit longer. So if you have time when you finish to go to the carpet, you are going to lay these in the middle of your table because we have not painted today everything is dry on your paper so you'll lay these in the middle of your table and be sure that all of your oil pastels are put away in the basket make sure your spot is nice and neat and that is when you can go to the carpet also be sure you push your chair in before you go to the carpet I've noticed a lot lately that people have their chairs pulled out and it's hard to get around the room when that's going on all right, now I'm starting on the trees and I'm just kind of doing some scribbly lines. I'm not pressing down that hard because again, I wanna see the paint underneath, but this is just adding some texture. Trees are not flat and right now my tree looks flat, but when I add these scribbly lines, it gives my tree some texture and it makes it look a little bit more realistic. If you remember back to doing these last week we used two colors or some of you did so i also like to do that with the oil pastel here i'm using yellow scribbling my lines and now i'm going to scribble some orange in there where i use the orange paint remember you're the artist so you know what will look good here i'm just darkening that one tree to make it stand out more i'm adding some more red just have fun with this make these look good i can't just can't wait to see what they look like have fun